Good morning, guys. It's time for Wilson Waves. The guys from First Power for an hour are here. It's going to be an awesome day. What's up, baby? You. Are you, are you, are you ready? Always. <laughs> What's up, Pete? Good morning, sir. How are you? It's awesome. It's about six o'clock. The guys are here. The interesting people are here. Guess who I passed coming up the road? What'd you pass coming up the road? Rodriguez is on his way here. <laughs> Is this uh, the best air conditioning ever? It's like a parasol. <laughs> it's awesome. You got these three spots in the cones. Okay. that owns that as a race car driver. Congratulations. Yeah. 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 Yeah
The show is now complete because Kathy's here. West is the guy who makes all of the photography so, happen. Baby. He's the guy who coordinates Thank this event. West. We're, we're here at Wills and Waves, uh, the best show on the planet. I, I have, I'm a little biased. <laughs> uh, well, I, I have to agree. Yeah. yeah. Uh, this is Michael. Uh, uh, props. <laughs> uh, Michael brought in an amazing car today. Uh, but your company builds these cars, right? Correct. What's your company name? Mag Motors. Okay. Which is magmotors.com. It's magstang.com. We went with the name of the car. Okay. M-A-G we'll stang.com. So why this car? What's so special about these cars for you? Oh, man. I'm a 67 Shelby fan all through and through. The problem is I, I had one and the wife said, I don't like driving in it anymore. It smell like gas. Yeah. You can't start the thing on thing. Right. So the concept was, okay, well, let's get a new one. Ah. But we, nobody liked the body of the new one. Right, right. I still missed my 67. Oh, yeah. So uh, the concept basically arose, you know, four years ago. And I said, listen, I have to absolutely get my 67 back. Nice. But let's build it on the new one. Oh, yeah. Fantastic. <laughs> you guys have done a ph phenomenal job. Thank you. The car's amazing. Thank you. Uh, we're going to do a photo shoot with this later on in a separate episode. But uh, for now, let's kind of take a look at what you got. Absolutely. Okay. Mm -hmm is brand new Shelby. Fantastic. So it's basically a uh, complete Shelby chassis with every component of the new car. Technologically, as far as drivetrain, yeah. brakes, suspension, we've kept all the suspension geometry the same. The electronics are our OBD2 connection of the new car with the computer. Drives like a brand new car. The car now handles like a go-kart. So it's a wider track car with a little slightly narrower center body where your seating position is. The car handles like a brake. Donnie and Spence from Horsepower for an Hour. You guys did a phenomenal job today. Hey, it was a lot of fun. Had a great time. So much fun. What, uh, with all these cars, what stood out for you as your favorite? The DeLoreans. Three DeLoreans <laughs> in nice. one place in beautiful Malibu. Well, right? Thanks for coming. The show is a success. Uh, if you guys want to hear more about what these guys do, it's Horsepower for an Hour. What's the website? Horsepoweronline.com. Well, that's true. i got to get some food in me. By the way, Bricklin. Bricklin's going by. Check it out. There he is. Bricklin right there. Gorgeous. Uh, all right, we're gonna go get something to eat because yes, that's, that's what we do. your truck Wes it's all ready for you why are you always photobombing my pictures everywhere you go there's cool cars in town that was John Graffin just walked by he's not a cool car but he's a cool guy he's very grafty yeah he's a strange guy sometimes too
incredible day at Wheels and Waves. Spectacular day. Big thanks to the guys from Horsepower for an hour. He came and joined us. Super big thanks to uh, comedian, dancer, performer, actor, singer, amazing all around man. Dick Van Dyke. Also, big thanks to the guys that uh, that gave me all these shirts and things. Uh, this is from Horsepower for an Hour, right there. One's from Beach Coast Insurance. Check that out, those guys. Uh, I I really appreciate uh, when people bring me these shirts and things. It's a very cool thing. I, I'm I'm very grateful for that. Uh, although these shirts are too large, I can't I can't wear them. So if you if you want to give me a shirt, and I'm truly grateful that uh, you're gonna give me a shirt, and I will wear it. You know, this is Chicago today, but I will wear the shirt on the show for sure. But I wear a medium, and these these would be like wearing a big blanket. They're they're too large. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna I'm gonna re-gift this to you guys. In an upcoming vlog, I will be able to give some of these some of these things away. They're super cool. Thanks guys for giving them to me. But I need to I need to wrap up this vlog with something that's a little bit difficult to talk about. As I said uh, previously, I, I'm always amazingly grateful that uh, that people bring their cars out to Wheels and Waves and they have a good time. And that's the whole point of a show like this is to have fun. But in order to have fun, uh, you have to drive on Pacific Coast Highway to get out here, whether you come from the north or whether you come from the south. Now the other day, something uh, truly unfortunate, truly horrible happened. Some of you guys may have seen me on Channel 7 News uh, yesterday. And if you did happen to see me on the news, then you probably know why. But uh, if you didn't get a chance to see that, we had a very, very sad occurrence on PCH right out in front of our house yesterday morning. And that was a an elderly lady was making her way along Pacific Coast Highway. I've seen her before. She kind of walks down the highway, then crosses and does a variety of things. Um, in, in a normal occurrence, it would be very dangerous because there's lots of traffic, but there wasn't any traffic. Um, but in this case, uh, this woman made her way across the highway and unfortunately was hit and she was killed. A very sad story indeed. And uh, it, it, it conveys to me something, a, a message that's truly very important. And I, and I can't stress this enough, is that your life can change in an instant. Uh, for many reasons, driving on Pacific Coast Highway uh, through distractions, and distractions are, are ever-present, but we have to make sure uh, as we drive these cool cars to and from uh, the places that we want to go, the car shows, the different things, that we're, that our attention is focused, and it's focused on driving so that we have a good time and we bring joy to others by, by bringing those cars out. But it's very important, guys, that if you're driving a PCH, it's basically like a freeway, and uh, it's not a normal freeway because people walk their dogs, they walk uh, their kids, uh, they cross over, there's cars coming in and out, there's all kinds of things that are happening. And if you're not aware, if you don't pay attention, then unfortunate things can happen and that's what happened recently. But I can't stress enough, I'm not uh, trying to bring in a negative aspect to the, the end part of the vlog, but this is very important. I need for you guys to, to enjoy this life with me. Racing belongs on the track. Uh, don't let anyone ever say anything else. Uh, I've been there, I know I've driven like an idiot. We all have. We've all driven poorly and done things they probably shouldn't have. But it's important to learn our lessons and not have to take lives or hurt ourselves in the process. I'm having so much fun doing this and I'm having so much fun hanging out with you guys, being able to share what it is that we're doing with, in our life and with the car shows and all the different things that we want to do. And I want to be able to share the positive aspect of that. And every now and then I have to mention certain things that are very important. Okay, that's it for today's vlog. Thanks for watching. Uh, be sure to subscribe if you haven't, or you can always go over to the blog and you can subscribe at fireballtim.com. There we have all kinds of articles and uh, all kinds of really cool car stuff that's happening that isn't happening uh, if you subscribe just through YouTube. Our job is to help you improve your life through what you love. I love this stuff. I know what you guys love. Peace out, people. Love you. Talk to you tomorrow.